Hello everybody and welcome to the channel, I am Numpy Nuts and today we're going to get into the Fallout 4. I haven't played this for about 9 years, but you know what, I'm just going to go straight out and make a brand new game. Brand new game. So any of you guys that don't know about Fallout 4, it is set after Fallout 3. Um, <laughs> there's not much I can tell you. Uh, I don't remember this game that much. I, uh, I kind of played it a lot nine years ago, nine, eight years ago, and then never touched it again because I started playing Fallout 76. Um, but now, since the 25th of April, they've had the brand new update, and here we are. So let's just sit back, War. enjoy, and watch. War never changes. In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. Pip-Boy won. In the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. That's how you play as him, I think. I'm sure that's who you are. Year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For, for my, my son? Infant son. Not infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing. I was wrong, you weren't the guy in the power armor. I thought you were. It's the war. War never changes. War never changes. I'm not really bothered at what I look like. Um, he's a handsome chap already. You know what, I think he's a handsome guy, I'm just going to go with that. I I'm going to be wearing ha a, a mask, probably most of the time. Um, so I'll be alright. It's Codsworth. So this is before... This is before the bombs drops. I wonder if this is still here when the bombs drop. Thanks, Cuddler. Enjoy your coffee, sir. Well, oh, there's the Vault Tech uh, guy over there, outside. In his, in his little car. What am I supposed to do is I've got coffee. Can't run. Where, where's the bathroom? Still that door over there. The uh, Vault Tech representative. It's a Mr. Handy fuel. There's, there's the little Mr. Handy box he came in. 
Pretty cool. Oh, fair enough. Oh, I see ya. Hello. Go on. I'm just gonna play sarcastic. I'm here now. Much of your time. Time being a, um, a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre selected for entrance into the local vault. One eleven. One eleven. Uh, sounds great. Oh, it is. Believe you me. Now, you're already cleared for entrance in the unforeseen event of uh, total atomic annihilation. <laughs> I just need to verify some information. That's all. Sarcastic. <laughs> That's the spirit. Now, let's see. Um, do a lot of strength to be fair. Uh, to be honest, I'm gonna start with five on everything. Can it? Can you do four on everything? First four on everything is probably a good thing to start us. Uh, army names there as well. Um, I'll just be Owen since my name is Owen. Thanks again. <laughs> Just close the door on his face. <laughs> a little bit more, right? For you and uh, <laughs> Just close the door on his face. <laughs> oh, that was brilliant. And the, the baby's crying again. Mr. Owen. He's a baby. Ah, oh, fine. Spinning it before. I was spinning it before, Nora. Hey, how's my little guy? Much better now, huh? Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could have some bad for this. Weather should hold up. Will it be like Sarcastic. A year ago? Sir, Mom, you should come and see this. Codsworth, what's wrong? Uh oh. Uh oh. oh my Please stand by. We need to get to the vault. Now! Residents of Sanctuary House, if you are registered, evacuate to vault. Run! Come on, wife and, wife and son. They're just running pretty fast for that kid. Everyone's panicking. Has someone's been shot. If you're in the program, step forward, otherwise, return home. 
Huh. We need to get in. We're on the list. Infant. Adult male. Adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. I like I like the army uh camouflage on the uh, on the power armor. This is full tech security. such a weird vault, isn't it? I don't say any nukes. Almost there. We're gonna be okay. I love you. Both of you. We love you too. Oh my god! Oh, there's a nuke. Hold on! The one just stood still like nothing happens. Whoa! Almost just died. Almost just bloody died, didn't I? Mr. Russell, Mr. Abel, Miss Abel, Miss Whitfield, Mr. Whitfield. Not many people came in the vault, mind. Everyone, please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home. Vault 111. Excuse me. Yes, up the stairs. Oh, there's the overseer. Oh, text stuff. Where? Oh, right. I like how they're trying to sell us, even though we'll have to live here now because the world has went to hell. Yeah, they probably probably didn't. Probably didn't. Mr. Callahan. Hello. Hey, just step into the chamber. She was, she was about to say help me with Sean or something there, but I've just jumped in and left them. Ah, oh, that's all right. They're in. That's <laughs> a cry, your pod man. I like how they're just like the light here. Because now you think it's gonna. It's gonna like. Get rid of the radiation or something like that and sterilize you. Uh, for the new revolt, but it's actually a cryo chamber. Oh, waking up. It's been like 200 years or something like that. So you, you'd think that you wouldn't re realize that you were in cry or sleep. You'd think you were just being like passed out for a couple of minutes. Oh God! There goes your wife. Oh, I'm the backup, am I? 
I'm the backup. And back to sleep. Back to sleep. And then how do we wake up? How do we wake up? Does the vault just fail or something? Alright, oh, so it just fails. It just automatically fails then. I wonder what happened to the overseer and everything. Come on! There has to be a release! Come on, come on, come on! Oh god! I'll find you beat this. And I'll get Sean back. Oh. Can I not get everyone else out? Oh, uh, everyone's died. Miss Callahan, deceased caused death asphyxiation due to life support failure. Ah, uh, everyone's died. Remote override engaged. Where's Nora and Sean? Ah. Right, so let's have a look. Let's go out here. Right. Accessible. Uh, might as well take some stuff, I guess. Oh, there's a rad roach. And punch. How do you put your fists away? X. Stim pack. No guns or anything anywhere. Hello, mother. F oh. You dead. Roaches? What the hell? Yeah, you wouldn't be very, uh, be very confused, wouldn't you? Go to sleep. <laughs> ah. So something's went wrong here. Something's went very wrong with this vault. What happened here? He's killed himself. Let's have a look. Oh, that's the overseer. He's killed himself. Uh, Oversee instructions. Um, open evacuation tunnel. That's probably a good one. Um, supplies running low. There's been no all clear signals yet, even though we're near the end of the the 180 day mandatory shelter period. Ah. Uh, So they ran out of supplies and he killed himself. Oh, some st stim packs. And a nice little pistol. Nice. Coming back later for you. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. When do you get your pit boy? Should I, should I not have that yet since I don't have a um, pit boy? On the middle one. Oh, I had him. <laughs> Just whack him with a with a pistol. As much red rush meat as I can, I suppose. A little bit, a uh, little something to sell when I get out of this place. 
Vault 1 and 2. That's what that means. Boop. Oh, well, there's the, uh, the doctor. Someone here as well. Did anyone get out? More rounds. Some more suits. Come here, you. Got your bitch. Right, you need a pit boy. So I'm gonna guess the pit boy's down here. Wait, is this door now opened? I had to go all the way around that. Now it's open. What's this place? Oh, I keep pressing RB instead of LB, man. For uh, VATS. That's just different people. Why has Cindy got a different name? All dead. Can't be the only one left. Hello? Two old bastards. Anyone? Vault 11 new shirts. I found a new new vault one. Oh, yeah. Oh well there's the pip boy. Get it off his wrist, I suppose. Let's get that fitted! Oh, a very old Pip Boy 3000 or 2000 or whatever it is. Yay! Utility jumpsuit. That gives you intelligence. The utility one. Doesn't look as cool like, does it? And time for that iconic noise! Didn't know like it was gonna work, does it? Doesn't know like it's gonna work. I didn't have a clue why I was moving there. Now let's leave this place. Let's leave this place. Uh, I'm pretty happy with everything that I've got, to be fair. Attributes and uh, what I look like. Oh. And now we're seeing the, the outside for the first time. Find the cache of vault jumpsuits. Is that literally a mission? Where's quests? Well, this is a lot of stuff. Find a kill pyro. It's a caravan. Listen to the mysterious signal. Investigate the merchant workshop. Where was the vault electronic store? Listen to the vault, vault tech stress signal. This is a lot of stuff, isn't it? Uh, vault tech stress signal. This has been a pre-recorded message. Message repeats in three seconds. Help! They're gonna kill me.
Mysterious signal? I'll do all this later on. Um, let's just go home. Let's go home to Sanctuary. Such a pretty game. Hello, it's Codsworth. I mean, you don't live and breathe. <laughs> What's happened? Uh oh. Dead. They, they killed her. They killed her. Sir, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, I, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's the need to improve proper family activity. Checkers, or perhaps charades. Sure does so love that. Does look. What checkers and charades when he's a kid? Uh, have you seen Sean? Codsworth, listen to me carefully. Have you seen him? Have you seen Sean? Why, the, the missus had him last, remember? Or perhaps she's gone to the Parker residence to arrange a play date. I'm sure she'll be back with him momentarily. He's gone. They stole him. Damn it. Someone took him. Someone stole my son. It's than I thought. Mm. You're suffering from hunger induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. 200 years? Are you 200 years? Times people will withhold information or caps. You can attempt to pursue them and share them both. You okay? Holiday? A holiday? What's on it? I believe it's a private message for you. My etiquette protocols would not permit me to play it for myself. Any standard holiday breeding device should be able to play it back. Oh, like that pip toy on your arm. That should work brilliantly. Now, enough feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? The missus and young Sean may turn up dead. <laughs> Yes. Lead the way. How to serve, sir? Um, am I hungry? 
Do you get hunger in this game? I don't remember if you do. Do you get hungry in this game? There's a power bur power workbench. Some other stuff. Oh. Oh, over there. Cages. So this is everything you can build. Where's he gone? There's a, there's a bloat fly. Better take care of that. Well, I think it's going to be anywhere. What's cycle damage? Ah, what's perk chart? Ah, Codsworth. Mr. Owen. Mr. Owen. Oh, you know what I want to do? I want to go up my house um, and see if there's that, see if there's that Grognite Barbarian fit. I was wondering what the hell that was there. Which house was it? Is it this one? Yeah, it was this house. Oh, it's still there, yeah. Your critical hits and unarmed melee attacks apparently do 5% damage. Alright. Ooh, yes. Can you, like, uh, transfer? What's this transfer do? Store all junk. Scrap. I want to scrap that. Might as well keep them both. So if one gets starts getting damaged, if do they have durability in this game? Uh, it doesn't look like they do. Which is good, I guess, because it means you have to keep repairing stuff. Sean's out there. Sean's out there, Codsworth. I need to find him. What about Concord, sir? Plenty of people there. I must say, Chet, they only troubled me with six of the new flies before I had to be brought back home. I like these people. Sarcastic. Investigate Concord. Right, let's go and investigate Concord. It's just uh, just this way. Let's go.